Damn, scene 36, take three, take two. Perfect. Action. Damned is a supernatural thriller. Uh, it definitely draws from, you know, supernatural lore in a sense. Uh, but I think that there's this very strong thread of faith and, um, and reconciling that with all this turmoil that the characters are going through. And I'm thinking, okay, what can I do that's different? The concept itself came up about two years ago, and I wanted to do something that was different. I wanted to step outside the circle from any typical project that's usually getting done by primarily African-American uh, directors. Next thing I knew, I'm, I'm writing and I'm halfway through a screenplay about angels and demons, Lucifer, and all these other cool names. It was about two years in the making of just writing, waiting for the right moment, and uh, finding a dynamic cast to uh, help it come true. I have to say, one of the best projects that I've worked on. I like the footage I've seen so far, because I really believe in the project, so I'm doing everything I can to push it to make sure that we get that fan base that we need, because I really want to see it succeed. Only has it been professional, it's also been a lot of fun. I've met a lot of people that I really enjoy working with. So, um, I would say it's been the best experience I've had. I wouldn't trade it for the world. I got to act in it, and I got to be the demon with the horns, and that was a lot of fun. That's kind of the first time I've ever done anything like that. No falling world. I don't know anyone. World. Working with the crew was much more than I ever expected. It definitely have been. It definitely challenged me, and it's brought my makeup to like another level. The story's captivating. Hi, my name is Joe Feldman, and I play the character of Posh on the web series. <laughs> <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Posh is interesting. Um, Posh has a little bit of an inferiority complex going on. He, um, he's the youngest of, uh, of his sibling. He has his own unique way of sort of dealing with that. And it's just interesting to see how he ends up developing as the course of the series goes on. What do you mean it's not my business? He needs my protection. How? Actually, the human needs your protection. Dealing with uh, situations where you want to be accepted or want to be the best that you can be and have all these people to look up to, that's something I can relate to. That's something Paj deals with. <laughs> Paj. Well, I'm not really sure. His name is Paj, but considering everyone is destroying... Here's the Pooj. Yeah. I'm going to change it to Paj, P-A-J. Uh, it is a game, recently, to continue to find new ways to say the name off and on set. Right now, I'm having some fun on set, doing a little fight choreography, which is a little different from some of the things I have done. It's always fun to be on set. Something is happening. <laughs> and it's a good time, always. There's some singing, there's some dancing. <laughs> Mostly Kevin. Uh, Samantha carries a lot of weight. Uh, she's a very intense person. She's uh, dealing with a lot of personal issues related to uh, her family and her faith. And she's always trying to make things better, improve things, uh, be worthy of uh, returning to heaven. <laughs> Please, give me something. That intensity and that worry and that guilt is very present at times, and it's interesting to play a character who is constantly struggling with that. I mean, there's there's humor in the series, but but Samantha is uh, kind of always carrying some sort of burden. I, in the context of the series, there's a lot that she suddenly has to fight for, so uh, it's a little violent. Um, it's kind of exciting. But the fight sequences are my favorite. Because <laughs> uh, I get to beat people up, and I get to act all badass. Rip out somebody's heart, and it's gross and wonderful. Got my butt severely kicked by uh, Samantha, um, Miriam Pultro, and uh, that was the night I took the uppercut. Had a lot of makeup done. Uh, Karen Sidberry, Jessica Ramos, fabulous. I mean, they really help these actors and the characters these actors are portraying come to life. And. Uh, Spent a lot of hours in the chair, getting the makeup application done, but uh, yes, that was one of the characters I played. And uh, I'm interested to see where they go from here. I mean, there's a lot that changes for Samantha in particular um, within this, especially this season, if you will. Um, but I, I'm excited.
excited to see where it goes after, after this. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to miss a lot of things. It's just getting me amped up to work on the next project.